The interim government has given special executive magistrate powers to the Bangladesh Army across the country, including the capital. Commissioned officers of the Army have been given this power. This decision was announced in a notification of the Ministry of Public Administration on Tuesday, the 17th of September, 2024. This decision has been implemented from the date of issuance of notification, i.e., Tuesday. This decision will be in force for the next two months. As a result, if any crime is committed in the presence of the Army officers who have the responsibility of executive magistrate, they can arrest or order the arrest of the criminal. Army officers can also take other necessary action against criminals under these sections. After the special power was given to the Army, there was a strong demand for military training of the students to protect the country's sovereignty. Some revolutionary students say there is no alternative to protecting their own country from neighboring countries. Binyamin Mola, the leader of the Student Rights Council, Chatra Odikar Porishad, said that military training should be arranged for all of us to protect the sovereignty of Bangladesh from Indian aggression. He also says that these revolutionary students should now be given military training. If India comes to attack Bangladesh any time, we should be ready to face it. We want to tell India that you are trying to destabilize this country in various ways. You have used Bangladesh for so long with this Awami League, with Sheikh Hasina, with your slave government and your maid. You have controlled this country. As a reward for Sheikh Hasina, you sheltered her in her time of danger. An independent sovereign country's military can never be monitored by another country. I want to say clearly that if you want to play with Bangladesh, we are also preparing to play. Who gave you the courage to look after the army of Bangladesh? We are also saying that India's army will also be monitored by Bangladesh. And we are ready to face you with our other friendly countries.